welcome to clickmyprocess.com this is our title mining frequent pattern without candidate generation frequent pattern three uh, three approved and this is our project abstract uh, in this existing parallel mining algorithm for frequent type of set lack of mechanism that enables automatic parallelization load balancing data distribution and fault tolerance uh, on large clusters as a solution to this problem we design a parallel frequent item set mining algorithm called fidoop using the mapreduce programming model to achieve compressed data storage and avoid building conditional patterns basis uh, fidoop process cooperates with frequent item ultrasonic uh, tree uh, rather than the conventional fptrees in fidoop uh, the mapreduce jobs are implemented to complete the mining task in crucial third uh, third mapreduce job the mapper independently decomposes items that the reduces performs combination operations by uh, constructing small uh, ultra metric trees and the actual mining of these trees Uh, separately we implement fidu on our uh, in house uh, hadoop clusters we show that a fidu on a cluster is sensitive to the data centric and uh, distributions and uh, dimensions because item sets uh, with a different uh, length have different uh, decomposition and construction costs to improve fidu performances we develop a workload balance metric to measure load balance across the clusters computing nodes we develop fidu hd and extensions of fidu to speed up the mining performances for the high dimensional data analysis extensive experiments using real world uh, Uh, spectral data demonstrations that our proposed solutions is efficient and scalable uh, item set mining is a core problem in association rule mining uh, sequence mining under the like uh, speeding up the process of fim uh, frequent item mining is crucial and uh, in uh, un, uh, in in indispensable because uh, frequent item mining consumption accounts for a uh, significant portions of mining time due to its high consumption and the input output uh, intensity when data set in modern data mining applications became excessively a large sequential fim algorithms running on a single machine suffers from the um, performance uh, deteriorations to address this issues we investigate how performance how to perform frequent data mining using mapreduce a widely adopted program mining tools uh, model for proposing big data by uh, exploiting the parallelism among the computation nodes of a cluster we show how to distribute a large data set over the clusters to balance a load across all clusters nodes thereby optimizing the performance of parallel frequent item mining frequent item free frequent item set mining algorithms can be divided into two categories namely a priori and fp growth schemes a priori is a classic algorithm using the generic uh, generations and the test process that generates a large numbers of candidates item set a priori has to repeatedly uh, scan an entire database to reduce the time required for scanning databases most previously uh, most previously developed parallel uh, frequent item mining algorithm we built upon the a priori algorithm unfortunately in a priori like unfortunately in a priori like parallel frequent mining algorithm each process has a, a number of candidates item sets without processes therefore a priori like uh, parallel frequent item mining solution suffers potentially problem of high input output and signalization overhead which makes it uh, strenuously to scale up these pro- these parallel algorithms the scalability problem has uh, uh, been addressed by the implementations of the uh, handful of fp growth like parallel parallel frequent mining algorithm a major disadvantage of uh, frequent um, frequent pattern growth like uh, algorithm uh, however lies in the fe- in uh, infeasibility to construct in memory uh, fp tree to accommodate large uh, scalable database uh, this problem becomes more uh, pronounced when the uh, when it comes as a massive and multi uh, multi dimensional databases and this is our data flow first will be starting then data set selection will be carried out then the data set will be uploading into a database then pre processing technique will be carried out in this pre- in this pre- in this pre processing technique we will be carrying out in the process like removing the unwanted data and the irrelevant data and the data which is restricted and the data which has been missing a values then uh, error correction of a free data set will be carried out then analysis informations will be carried out for the data which has been get loaded into the databases then partition of the data will be carried out for a frequent item mining and the entire data will be get partition into an attribute manner then the threshold value will be founded for get uh, the frequent mining and then the clustering algorithm will be uh, used for uh, getting the data uh, from the entire database then the support and free conference level will be get founded then the frequent items which will be get mer- will be get uh, enlarged then after that the matching and results will be uh, calculated and then this is an end process and, uh, this is our project uh, just right click on our home and click on our run file
will be getting a home screen just click on the here we will be getting a screen like this in this choosing a data set I'll be choosing a data set online detail and open and load data set loader successfully this is our entire data set and next and this will be pre-processing pre process successfully loading to information selector next process will be uploading into an STFS process that is being it uploaded successfully uh, map and reduce process will be get uh, reduced map and reduced like this map and reduce completed next process will be calculating a C4.5 predictions entropy uh, gain result is being calculated in this prediction one I can view that on prediction two you can able to see a difference in this for prediction two you can able to see a quantity differences in this I'll be uh, getting a frequent mining this is of frequent mining for particular customers frequent mining for particular customers and a graph in this on graph bidding a prediction and accuracy rate uh, which is uh, going to tell us the performance of a frequent item mining uh, thank you